Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate your time. So I'm going to be briefly talking about this whole thing with um, this white lady, this Karen, trying to body shame this worker at Burger King for, you know, <laughs> accusing her of her uniform being um, too sexy and distracting her husband. Listen, I'm sure a lot of black women can relate to the situation and understand that our bodies are different, um, just like our hair. We fit and fill out clothes in different ways and sometimes, you know, <laughs> <laughs> insecure white women will try to make our bodies wrong or make us the wrong um, person for just existing how we are. And I just wanted to briefly say this is completely ridiculous. So apparently um, this woman goes into Burger King and she tells the worker that her uniform is distracting her husband. This is what she says, quote, I had a lady complain today because my uniform was a distraction to her husband. I'm sorry I'm laughing, but this is just, this is just so ridiculous. The lady's name is Layla. Um, she's a mom of one and she is, she is Sudanese. Um, she is actually a biochemistry student. You know, she's just basically trying to, she's just trying to work. She's trying to take care of her family and make a better life for herself. And you have this white woman who, you know, began shaming her. And I'm, mind you, I'm looking at her uniform now. Uh, if, if, if it's nothing wrong with her uniform it's really it's really not like if there if she was like wearing something where I felt like would be inappropriate um for working at an establishment where children will come in and see you I would say that but I'm looking at her uniform now there is absolutely nothing that would cause me to believe that she is wearing anything that's largely inappropriate I just think like I said uh, black women, we are shaped differently. We will fill out clothes differently. That's just the way that it is. <laughs> White women since the beginning of time have had issues with our differences. I feel bad for her because this is, this is really the type of things that happen to black women often. You know, just us existing, us living our lives at work, um, <laughs> trying to do what we're supposed to do. And unfortunately we are, accosted <laughs> um, or just or maybe not accosted that's well no in some situations we're accosted but just forced to deal with things that are very much rooted in racism and, and other types of discrimination and it's just sad and I mean it's like now you have Monique out here doing this whole anti violent thing and <laughs> Then you have black women in our uniform and we just can't be working without people complaining about how we look then. It's just like, it's it's ridiculous. It's too much. I just think that when you're in this, when you are in a situation, right, and you are dealing with someone who is body shaming you, just realize that similar to when you're dealing with colorism, the issue is more about them and their perspective and how they feel about certain things rather than you. So don't internalize it. Don't feel like you're wrong. Don't feel like you need to change. Just completely disregard that person and their ridiculous opinion and continue to live your life. So that's all I have to say on that. Um, thank you so much for watching and take care. Bye.